We are following breaking news for you. Crews searching for two little boys who were thrown into the Ohio River get a glimmer of hope that they are closer to some answers. Yeah, Paula, so far it's been a really tough task to look for Nilo Lattimore and James Hutchinson. Local 12's Alexa Helwig is live with new developments in this case. Alexa. Kyle Paula, I just got off the phone with the Butler County prosecutor again, and at this hour, no new information or updates just yet. But he believes crews may have found a body in the Ohio River, but a body has not yet been recovered. Now, we are on the Kentucky side of the river in Petersburg, right across the river. That is Indiana, and that's Lawrenceburg area. That's where police believe that um, six-year-old James Hutchinson's body was thrown into the river. So the search has been on for weeks for James and three-year-old Nilo Lattimore, who police also think could be in the river. The Butler County prosecutor tells me sonar and a cadaver dog detected something that investigators are confident could be human remains. I also talked to North Star International today. It's an independent search and recovery group who says those hits were actually made this past weekend, but it was too dangerous to send in divers. So today, crews from the Boone County Water Rescue and Hamilton County Police Association have been scouring the area. I've seen them focus near the Carroll Cropper Bridge. They are just searching for answers for these families and prosecutor Mike Moser is thankful. The interest in this case is uh, absolutely phenomenal, but I think it's important. Normally I don't give interviews, as you know, I'm pretty <laughs> reticent when it comes to that. But I think it's important to give credit to where credit is due, and that's especially these people that are risking their lives to help me prosecute these cases. And I really appreciate it, and I want them to know it, and I want you to know it. And all is kind of calm in the area, but I'm still told that crews are still in the river searching. They've been there for since early this morning, but again, a body has not yet been recovered. I'm told they'll search until dark. Reporting live in Petersburg, Alexa Helwig, Local 12 News. All right, Alexa, thank you for those updates this evening. And supporters of the Lattimore family want to help out. There's actually a fundraiser to help the family pay for Nilo's funeral expenses. It's going to be held Saturday, March 27th from 2 to 6 at Stoney's Pub on Carthage Avenue in Norwood. An entry fee, basket raffles, and split the pot will all help to raise funds.